Hello everyone, I'm Peter. In this video, I'm going to unbox a new smartwatch. It is the DW35 Pro smartwatch. Firstly, we can see the box. The box is very similar as the FK99 smartwatch. And now let's open the box. And the inside box is also very similar as the FK99. Now let's open the box. Firstly, we see a watch. And uh, inside there is a silicon strap and the menu. Then we can see a wireless charger and another nylon band. And then let's check the watch and the strap. We can easily take out the watch. This watch is 44mm and also can fit the 42 and 44mm original Apple Watch straps. And uh, this watch has two buttons at the right side and both buttons are functional. But this one is the power on button. And uh, here is the microphone. And we can see the back. There is no lock button and also no charging interface due to this watch is wireless charging and here is the speaker and now let's power on the watch and this one is the power on button we can long press for 5 seconds and then the watch will power on and the first three we see a language list and this round button can also rotate to make the selection. Firstly, let's check the watch faces. We can hold the screen and also can rotate the round button. It has 33 watch faces inside the watch, but it can also customize watch faces through the app. And now let's check the functions of these two buttons. We can press this round button to activate the screen and also off the screen. And we can press this round button and this long button cannot activate the screen. When the screen is activated, we can press this button to go to the dialer. And then let's test the quick actions. From the top to the bottom, we can go to the dialer. From the bottom to the top, we can go to the control center. We can see the motion, the ringing, and also flash light, and the Bluetooth, and also the battery. And here is the menu style. This watch has three menu styles, the nine app style, six app style, or smart style. And then let's check the three menu styles. Firstly, the six apps. And then the nine app style. And then the smart style. And then from the right to the left, we can go to the pedometer. And we can see the steps, calorie, and the blood pressure. And then the heart rate, we can tap to measure 
the heart rate. And the, the Bluetooth music, you can see this function can also control the volume and the notification. Now I have put on the watch on my wrist and then now let's test the, the functions. Firstly, the weather, we need to connect the watch with the phone. And the uh, exercises, it has many exercises. And then the heart rate, we can tap to measure the heart rate. And also the blood pressure. And the blood oxygen. And the Bluetooth music. And the calendar. And the alarm clock, we can tap to add a new alarm clock here. And also the stopwatch. And the find the phone. And also the temperature. And the setting. We can see the Bluetooth setting. And the link to app. This is the app code. And uh, the clock face is and uh, also the time sync. If you want to change the time, you can turn the time sync off and then you can go inside to change the date and time and also the format. And also notification right and unit password. And the sound, volume, and also display. We can go to here to change the menu styles, also adjust the brightness, and also change the screen timeout. And we can see the maximum screen timeout is 60 seconds. And the international, and if you want to change the language you can go to here and turn the auto sync to off then change the language and reset and about we can see the device name is DW35 Pro and the message Also the dialer and the phone book. All these functions need to connect the watch with the phone. And the call logs and the Bluetooth connection and the pedometer and the message and also the heart rate and the sleep monitor we can move from the bottom to the top to change the status and also check the history and the remote capture and the center reminder you can set the time to remind you and the calculator and the also international the QR code and the motion And uh, the wake up gesture, this is the frequent used functions. And then the voice assistant, this function also need to connect the watch with the phone. And the power saving mode. And also the menu style. And the immunity, if you want to turn on 
and the games. It has one game. Then we can see the Facebook and Twitter, WhatsApp, and also the QQ and the WeChat app. These functions are all for synchronizing the incoming message notifications. It is unable to reply the messages. And also the power off. So above is all our details today. We will connect the watch with the phone and also test the detailed functions as well as the apps. If you like our video, appreciate you can subscribe our channel and like our videos. Thanks for watching. Bye.